Hey guys, I'm Messy Gamer here. I'm here with episode six of One Night. I think that's right. Um, let's get into it. Oh, that was loud. Okay. I didn't pass the fifth bar, but what is it? I love this. this a little bit because I didn't feel like running around getting lost every time I did this so has attempted to access and compose the automatic matter that was eliminated in our own universe at the time of the Big Bang. As such, it is responsible to assume, assume that the theory, the laws of physics, and the other universe are considerably, considerably different to ours. I've run some simultaneous... I can't talk. Simultaneous... I can't talk. And it is apparent that if an accidental merge were to occur, the results would be disastrous if the two universes were to mend together, meld together. These experiments are far too dangerous to continue. I must inform the administrator of this before the experiment tomorrow, before humanity itself is put at stake. Oh. Well, guessing you didn't do that, because we are in the
nervous. Please don't die if I get it wrong. Something, who, something, something up the something, something, something up. Um. See if I can find one of them. Unlock and enter. Read the orders on the desk and see the clue. What orders? Tell me what to do. I'm gonna have to edit and cut all this out. Dang it.
totally, I have, I have to look it up. Uh, I don't get how you get this, but, um... Unlock the next door with underground key that reads orders. Put a hint on how to unlock the closet. Take the power conduct. I, I don't know how to pronounce it. From inside. No, to unlock the closet and hit the words make green red. I don't get how you get this, but whatever. there show yourself it's okay I'm not gonna hurt you I just let's see it's you it it really is you I thought you hadn't survived yes although I'm afraid I don't recognize you you don't remember me I hope that maybe if you had survived your memory would have remained intact like mine but you lost your memories too, just like all the others. My name is Tiffany something. I am the one who brought you to this complex. You were the one who was helping me, but helping me put a stop to experiments being carried out here. I was here with you trying to stop the experiments, but that man, the administrator, he told me that whatever happened here was an accident. Accident, you're saying? I was hoping you could get that. Hmm. I think I better explain it all. If anything, I owe you a full explanation. Anyway, come and I'll tell you. Okay. I'm sure I'm sure that by now you've become aware of the types of experiments that were conducted at the complex. I think so. Some sort of physics experiment and they had discovered the apparent existence of another dimension and we're attempting to make contact with it, and that's how the man told me, that's what the man told me was a breach. Yes, you pretty much got it correct. You see, this complex was a laboratory the government established, disguised as a military facility, especially for research regarding this newly discovered phenomenon. The reason this place was chosen is because this was once the site of an old prison. That was very one we stand in now. Prison? Why would that make them choose this place to go to that? The experiment requires human test of this. The machine which created the breaches they study here is required a certain quantum quantum fluctuation to work a certain electrical charge. The only known source of the charge seems to be human brain. I was told that it may have something to do with the complexity of the human brain. I'm sure, I'm not sure how exactly. The prison here was, was re reopened 
and used as a storage area for test subjects who in this case were prisoners who were transferred from death row and other facilities to this compound. Indeed, this is the reason why we are trying to stop is this the reason why we're trying to try and stop the experiment? Some people thought it was inhumane at first, but the government approved it as long as the test subjects were not in the same facility. We weren't sent we weren't sent because of that. We were sent here to stop the administrators of this facility. Mr. Alex Mercier from initially using the facility to cause a merge instead of a breach. He caused the merge intentionally, but what exactly is a merge and why would he do such a thing? All I know is that the mer merge is the world merge is the world word that scientists here use to describe the event two dimensions using the image. Rather than just the small window between them, that would be a breach that a breach period. I don't actually know how such a thing happens or exactly what it entails, so you'll have to ask someone else about it. Uh, as for the reason behind Rashani wanting to create it, it's quite obvious. Money. We we at the CIA began investigate began to invest, investigate the matter and we soon discovered that a third party obviously interested in this potentially potential potential of emerge as a weapon had been paying much need to alter the calibration of the last question. Okay, so he was trying to create a merge move to see our con our con our contact in inside the compound helped us escape from the prison area and we split up from that point, each one of us hiding in a different area of the base, trying to find a way to stop the test occurring. Roshini came to know that we had escaped from our cells. He made his technicians reconfigure the equipment to his specification, claiming that it had been sabotaged to create merge, and he had us recaptured. How did he know that we what we were doing? I don't know. So someone must have been feeding him information on what we were planning. Anyways, anyway, when he had us recaptured, he promised that we would not, we had not foiled him, and that we would be his next test test subject. He chose you at first. I hope that my attempt to sabotage the tower would stop the equipment working, but of course they ran on a backup grid. The merge occurred, and now we are left in this aftermath. I suppose I should be lucky then. If what you say is true, the test subjects used for the experiments are killed. I wonder how I am able to survive the event. I heard the event after it already happened. It seems you attempted at the last minute to escape, throwing one of your captors into the machine instead. You must have run to the medical room to hide and blacked out when the merge finally consumed the base. Do you have any memory of the bright light that would the merge that that would be a merge occurring? I remember. And what happened to the others? Folks died in the merge, Robert and Roberts who was killed by that monster, just like everyone else. And and chased them all down and it chased them all down and killed them all one by one. I'm sorry, so you've seen that monster too? It stalks this complex looking for people who are still alive. It finds those who survived the merge and those who have survived the attack of those creatures. And it kills them. No nobody ever survives once it marks them as its prey. Soon it will kill us too. I don't know what it is or where it came from, but it is the reason why all of us, all the initial survivors aside from you and me and Barcini are dead. It chases me too. There must be some way to get rid of it. Anyway, I'm going to try to find a way out of this place. Maybe if we team up, we'll figure something out. Well, I'm not sure. The others tried to escape, but that monster hunted them down eventually. But maybe you're right. It's pointless going alone. We need to look at the uh, look out for each other. That's the spirit. Two heads are better than one. Now let's get to work on putting the power back online. That's the first thing we need to do. Oh, that was a lot of reading. Okay, so now we have a girl with us. Tiffany, is that it? I think it was Tiffany. Um. Whew. Did I miss something? I feel like I missed something.
He's found us again. What do I do? Save game. Oh, archive eight. Okay, guys, I'm gonna end this episode off here. Leave a like if you enjoyed. See you on another episode. Bye.